How to do internet marketing. Hey there, Brad Smith here. Today I wanna to tell you how you can set up internet marketing for your business. Now marketing sounds hard, it sounds tedious, and you, most people just don't know where to get started. And that's the same boat I was in. When I was starting my business, I wasn't really sure how to get content out there and how to get new customers to me. I thought all I needed was new leads that I was gonna call and that they would automatically sign up. Well, unfortunately, it's not that easy, and I'm gonna share with you six tips to make it a little bit easier for you so you can make a game plan. All right, tip number one, start doing SEO now. We've talked about this in our other videos, whether it's blogs, videos, or testimonials. Doesn't happen overnight, but after six to 12 months, you'll actually start getting new customers from the search engines. Tip number two, email marketing. This is something to set up right now. You can add your current customers, new customers coming in, and website visitors. That way, if you have a promotion or you wanna broadcast a message to them, you're able to through email. Tip number three, social media. I don't want you guys to be on every single social media platform. It's just too hard while you're trying to run your business. Use one platform where you know your ideal customer is. For us, that's LinkedIn. We know our ideal customers are on LinkedIn, so we spend every day updating and publishing and interacting with people on social media. Tip number four, word of mouth marketing and word of mouth referrals are always the best, we know that. Start telling your friends, your current clients, to ask other people to join them for your business. Tell, tell others about your business and just spread that word of mouth to your current customers. Tip number five, connect with other professionals. So this is a great free way to get more clients to your business. By connecting with other professionals in your industry, they can start sending clients to you when they hear that that person needs your service. Tell them how you're gonna benefit that client and then how they can reach out. Tip number six, be consistent. So whatever you choose, whether it's emails, social media, uh, reaching out to other industry professionals, be consistent, be omnipresent. Uh, most people will not be interested in your service when they first hear about you. So keep following up and keep showing your face in front of them at the right times. When that person's ready to hire you, they'll remember you from whatever platform you were reaching out on and they will contact you and, and, and hire you. Now we have clients that have signed up with us over a year later after we first reached out to them. We were able to stay in front of them, continue to email and see, show our content on social media. This is a great way to stay in touch. Thank you so much for watching and listening. I hope you guys join me for my TAR framework. This is where I'm gonna teach you how to use traffic, automation, and relationships to better your business. Talk soon. Hey there, my name is Brad Smith, owner and founder of HelpLink.com. It's my mission and my passion to help others with their business. So if I can be your coach, your mentor, or help you in any way, that's my goal. My goal is to bring you value. So let me know if there's anything I can help you with, and I look forward to working with you.